dumbbells and barbells. Uh, every gym in the world's got them. A lot of home gyms have them. My favorite exercises uh, with the different diameters of, uh, of dumbbells and barbells. So, talking normal, normal diameter. So stuff that you see in a gym, like all around the world, stuff with about a grip this thick. Um, my favorite lifts to do with with these types of uh, these type of tools: hammers on a preacher. Okay, probably, probably one of the best things you can have as an arm wrestler is this hammer strength position. Uh, keep your arm nice and close to your body and follow it down, okay, and come up. When you do the lift, focus on keeping your hand high and your angle tight. Make sure that you go, you see a lot of people kind of not going down all the way, but what's going to happen is um, it's, it's hard to measure exactly what you did unless you cross that kind of... Uh, perpendicular to, to gravity or you know where gravity can really have the most effect on your bicep so stay stay tight keep your angle high cross the 90 degree point and come back up and when you start to get too heavy you're gonna notice that this is gonna start to fail okay and that's when you can hurt yourself doing the lift so uh, Great lift, great for developing that you know, straight back posting pressure, which is so dangerous in arm wrestling. Uh, next thing I like to do with standard, standard dumbbells or barbells is just, just grip work. I've never been a fan of grippers too much just because I don't like that they squish into your own hand. I'd rather just work with my fingers. So, you know, just really simple. Just very, very simple, just do grip work, okay, like that, or with the dumb barbell, you know, just let it roll down. And I find that this kind of grip training is, uh, is way better than your standard grippers. Uh, more measurable, and uh, doesn't push back into your own hand. I think it's, I think it's a bit more functional, just my opinion. So when you're in the gym and you have these normal dumbbells, one of the first things that you want to do as an arm wrestler is, is thicken them up. Uh, that, that increased diameter is going to put more stress on your wrist for different lifts that you're going to do. Obviously there's a ton of lifts you can do with all these tools. I'm just showing you my favorite ones. So start to move into thicker grips. Uh, I've got some custom stuff I use. This is, I think, about a two-inch diameter. Uh, this might be, this might be between like a three and a half or so diameter. Um, and here's a longer one, and I think that this is a, a three-inch diameter bar. I've used, I've used these, these tools for all sorts of stuff throughout the years. A lot of people don't have access to this stuff. So you can get a lot of things. You can, you can just get a piece of plastic uh, to slip over uh, when you go to the gym uh, just, to, just to make your spin. It's not going to be that good because it's going to slide all around, but it's, it's better than nothing. Uh, some guys get, you know, the thick grips. This one's, a, this one's a Manus grip. And just put it over top of, over top of whatever you're working with to thicken it up. If you don't have these, that's no problem. You can just use regular fabric, okay? And roll it up. Or tape, a lot of people use tape. And once you have it thickened up, it's already gonna start to feel, have a way different feel, and it's gonna start to get more out into your, into your fingers. My favorite lifts to do with these are wrist curls. Um, when I do my wrist curls, 
there's kind of a sweet spot for the size of the dumbbell that you want to use. The bigger the diameter, the more you're going to have tie-in to your fingers. Uh, it's going to start to hit your wrist right away as soon as you start doing wrist curls, but the increase in diameter is going to hit your fingers more and more. Standard wrist curl looks like this. So when I come in, I really bunch up my fingers to make it to make it tight, okay? As tight as I can. Make that pocket. Pull it up. I rest at kind of like a 90 degree position. Like my arm is kind of like where I would be at the arm wrestling table. And I'm just gonna do my curls from here. So that's a two inch about. So it's got, you know, pretty good exclusivity on the wrist. Switch to a four. And there's gonna be way more finger tie-in, okay? So I'm gonna feel the pressure quite a bit further out. If I move to, uh, if I get something longer, like a barbell kind of thing, you can get pieces of steel. The best place to get steel is from junkyards. Junkyards, scrap metal yards, uh, the best place to get you know, cheaper steel to work with and just do one arm deadlifts, okay? So get in, your, get in the spot where just, you're really just testing uh, your one RM. Just get locked in and lift, lift, lift. So that's really my favorite exercise with barbells, dumbbells, hammer, wrist curls, grip work, one arm deadlift, super simple.